Well, hello and welcome to me, Justin Has Pants, or something. And today we're playing Layers of Fear. Let's get right into it, shall we? I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. So? Here we are, in my home, humble home of homes. And now we will journey into the layers of fear, into the demented mind of a painter. But we don't know his name, how do I pick things up? Ah, a dog moselle. Okay, so let's get started in our horrific adventure. Hello, Mr. Rat. Where are you going? Did the rat break my stuff and leave my sink running? How dare you leave my sink on? so dark. Oh, that's cool. I have a reflection. Look, it's me. And I'm standing in a pile of poop. A giant, enormous pileus of poopis. Still a little bit of exploring. I got a limp. What does it say? Looks like my address, the last name of Pop, 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 something, Pop, 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 something, a Pop, 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 something or other. I got a, I got a limpy, cause my leg is messed up. Wobble, wobble, wobble. Let's close the door, keep the baddies out. That's the way you do it. Close the door to keep the baddies out. We, sir, you, dear, like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to f act further than a prophylactic spraying. Please treat this letter as a final warning or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Dinton. Pesky, pes, pesty, pesty, pacification, pacificis. Show. I'm going mad, am I? A limp rats. An artist triumph, gallery opening, wows a critic. Some call him the new Caravaggio, others compare him to Van Eyck, and other Austro critic who was to remain unnamed, but he was just named, went on as far to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo. Any way you slice it, the expedition proved an immense, immense, immense success. A distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiancée, looking stunning in her black gown. Dot dot dot, revealing to us that the couple are indeed expecting. Ooh. I guess that paintbrush still works. <laughs> Anywho, carrying on, 
Let's see. All right, I already went into the bathroom of death with no death. Something over this way. Newspapers? Anything back behind here? No? Okay. Anything in here? Nope. Slide open. Read that letter. I'm sorry for yesterday. You were right. I overreacted. It's just that. This isn't about me. It's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in an imperfect world, it's worth to strive for perfection. Ah, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper, though. Promise me. Promise. Will. Me, you, talk. Love you. Later. Goodbye. Slide closed. Oh, that one's locked. Ooh. Nothing of interest here. That is the bathroom. Okay. What is this? Sir, I didn't touch the workshop just like you asked, although I can imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Yeah, open my door. No, not gonna go in there. No, close. Okay, sure, I'm gonna guess my office is upstairs. Let's hobble up the stairs now. Hobble away, Mr. Hobbleman. Oh, look, a piano. Let us go play some musical notes of such magnificent proportions. Let me go bingly dingly. Oh, yeah, sweet. Someone doesn't like my piano playing. Hmm. Oh, what the mother... Jesus. Hello. Man, baby? Is this my office? Oh, must be. Thank you for the key. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. Eh? Little Red Riding Hood? Oh, hello, Mr. Red Riding. Little, I'm, oh, I'm so hungry. Come down and eat your body up. Oh, I'm gonna pretend like um, your grandmama. Hello. I'm gonna eat your face. And that is the story of Little Red Riding Hood. I got electricity. What? What? Let's run this power bill up. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I've agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task, but I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There's no way in hell I'm using this and already regret emitting green to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone, Whispered Tale Publishing House. Well, Mr. Wis Williams, if your face. Alright, so we got the key. Let's go check out our art. Our splendor splendiferous art. I'll see the rest of the house later. Nope. I'm gonna go see that later. Have a great day. Whatever you are inside that room. Bye. See you later. Alligator. Gonna hit your face. And drive it. Swing. Cut. Whoa. Sounds. Why did the door close all by itself? Oh my god. Now I'm locked inside. Demented workshop office. Don't want to be here. Want to be home. Oh, look at how pretty I am. I'm so pretty. Oh, look at me. 
Look at all of my paintings on the wall. Look, an apple on a plate with a wine glass. Oh, woe is me, I'm dead forever. Can I zoom in? Oh, I can't. I'm dead forever. I'm dead forever. Ooh, I'm so angry. And I'm the dragon that kills you when you're sleeping. Oh, yeah. What? Ah, that's just a tree. It's just trees outside my window. Open up my drawers. Close my drawers. Open up that drawer. Close that drawer. Anything? Nothing. Except my candles are about to ignite. Look at look look at my carelessness. This is probably flammable paints next to brushes and paper. And I put a candle right there. Oh my goodness. Am I just trying to lose my mind? Oh, okay. Alright, fine. Fine. You're fine. Whatever. Just be locked. Oh, oh hello, what is that? Okay. Looks like paint. Could be alcohol. Could be paint. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it's probably paint because those are brushes. That makes sense because I'm totally an artist. I forgot. Ooh, yeah. Look. Come sit in my chair. What the f Okay, that was just glass. I thought that was something crazy happening behind me. Yeah. Oh my god. What is that? Can we leave now? Oh, yes, we can. Oh. oh, I don't want to go in that way. I don't want to go that way. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna run through it. It's fine. Just close the door to keep the death out. Oh god, the death's probably in here with me. The death is in here with me. What? Just out of reach, you say? Okay. Alright. Oh, Shiza. Mother f I don't know where this accent just came from. Stupid, stupid closey windows. Stupid closey. Can, can I go now? Can I just... Are you serious? I can't go. What? Oh, okay. Oh, hello. How are you? Hello. Do not mind me. I'm just taking a casual stroll through my house. That's a lady on the piano. Probably my wife, who's probably dead because I killed her because I'm an evil artist. Plot twist. I don't care about the environment. Leave all these lamps on. Other plot twist. I'm going in circles. And now I'm truly confused. Is that paint? Or is it alcohol? I don't even know. A squeaky door open? Oh, look, it's changed again. Time for- oh. I don't like when you auto-close on me. Oh, that scary sounds of the, of the winds going by the wind. Plot twist. All the paint is actual human blood. Plot twist. Plot twist. How many twistings of the plot? Save the date. Blank requests the pleasure of your company to celebrate their wedding on Saturday, the 9th of June, at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Save the date. All right. Save the date. Slows it and slides it and snooze it. And that one's got a lock. There's whispering in my ears. Oh, God. No, we go over here. What's over here? What is that? I can't see. Oh, look. I can let... Oh, matches. Oh, my God. That was loud as balls. Five or four. Oh, that must be the combo nation. Shut up, whisper ears. Five. 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 Four. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. No. Oh. That was a huge lock. Who are y'all? The past holds back. Look closer. Okay. I thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So. Will you marry me? Yes. No. I don't know. Probably. Maybe. Oh, hey, look at the door. Never forget that you killed me, and I'm very angry. That chair is moving! Don't you try to scare me, chair. Don't you try... Chair stopped 
broken. Just gonna limp on. Limping on. What? The shizer. Okay, that's cool. Is there a light in here? Did you guys, did we put, we didn't put lights in this room? We were trying to save the environment or something? I don't know. So we skimmed on the lights, huh? No lamps, no lights, just a fire. A pretty fire. Look at that pretty, look at that pretty fire. Look at that pretty fire right there. Just burning them, burning good old coal. Oh my gosh. Your hickory chips. Oh, Domino! What the hell? Hello, Mr. Baby. Are you okay? Oh, God! Okay. I didn't... I was just asking if the... Baby was okay. I think there's something down here with me. Is there something with me? I can't... What is... What is that? Dust of mice, even in my lungs, there's always more. Grotesque vermin dirt. Hmm. Oh, there is a light. Right on! Sweet! Cool! Now I can look around. Okay, hey, what's up? Okay! Alright! That's cool! What the f was that? Um, that was not very nice, lady. I'm just gonna go now. Just gonna limp up these stairs. We'll make it one limp at a time. Yeah! Where are we going? Oh, and now the baby's up there. Okay. Hey, baby. How are you hanging? Oh, oh, death lady. Okay. You guys have a great day. I'm just gonna keep... Oh, God. Okay, that's just that thing closing. Okay, we're just gonna keep going. Alright, you guys have... Oh, somebody broke my stuff. What is that? That's a broke. Who broke that sheet? Did you break that? Did you break it? I don't know. Oh, Jesus Christ. Paint deep lies. Yeah. Oh, what is that? Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> yeah, baby. I want to get all those curves. Hello. Hello, Mr. Man. What is in this room? Is this the room of... Death. Let me drink books. What the? What? What? A rat just murder itself? What? What? Okay. 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 Oh, okay. Okay. Just keep just keep going. We'll just keep doing what we're doing. You just keep doing you, baby. And then they never take uh oh. Ruh row What happened here? Oh, their eyes have been gouged out of their faces. Oh, goodness. Gravy. Balls of fire. Open sesame. Anything in here to read? No. Close the door. Close the door. Swing. Swang. Wasting my time. Ah, look, it's stuff to read. Okay, cool. Hey. Hey, in regards to the previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby. Hormone imbalances and the like. When we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. 
I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she just burst into tears. Just be there for her. And I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now I know I promise not to rush you by all means. Enjoy your well-deserved time off. But just let to, to let you know, I'm getting phone calls up the yin-yang. Commissioner left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Maybe we should strike the iron when it's hot. But of course, the family comes first. Your friend and agent, Thomas Caldwell. Okay, thank you, Thomas. I want you to come to work, but you can put your family first. But I need you to come to work. If you want your family first. Nothing? Nothing? Nice glass door? Okay, cool. Alright. What am I doing? Is it this way? No? Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. I don't... She's like crying right behind me, I just... Just stay locked. Just stay locked. I don't. I don't want to deal with that. Oh, which way do I go? Cool. Sweet. We went the right way. Where the hell am I? Oh, I can't see anything. It's so dark. It's so dark. It's so dark. I can't see anything. Okay, all right, that's cool. Oh, hey, look, a hallway. Hey, hallway. Hope you're having a great day. That's fine. Let's tell now I'm in the kitchen. Okay, this doesn't make any sense at all. Hello, kitchen. Hello, what the hell? What the hell is happening? What the hell? What the hell is happening, guys? Oh, 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 no, oh, no, can I crouch? Can I hide? Can I do something? Can I do something? I can't do anything. Okay, okay, no, no, we wanna, okay, okay. What am I supposed to? Do something. Oh, sh okay. Oh, kid, okay. Well, you just have a great day, sir. Oh, no. Oh, sh oh, God. Oh, no. What do I do? Okay. What is that? First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hands steady. Think if I was cutting somebody up, I wouldn't use booze to keep my hand steady. Okay, well, hopefully nobody's gonna eat my face. And now we're back at the canvas place. Huh. Cool. 
Look at these blood flamingos. Blood flamingos. Gotta go ahead and end the episode right there. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope to see you on the next episode.